How's it going guys? Welcome back to the channel. If you are new around here, my name's John and this is Jay's Bargain. I buy and sell on eBay. That's primarily my business model. I'm moving into other things as well, but I'll go into that in the future. But today I'm really excited because our local car boot sale has just opened. So today I thought I would take you guys with me and show you exactly what we get. You got on these. Oh. Turn the reach, Turn it. <laughs> nice. Who's on this? It's yours. Yeah. How much for this? Three quid. What about your stethoscopes? Am I a doctor? <laughs> Hey, go on then, I'll do that for eight years. How much for that? Won't argue with that, two quid. Thank you. There you go, thank you very much. It's a nice little doctor's bag, leather, made in Italy. How much for all the pigs? How much for all them? Is it a full box then? I've no idea. Let's have a look. I don't know what you've got in there. Leonardo. Oh. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Good ten of the Go on then. What's that then? How much for the headphones? Check them chat. Three quid, yeah? yeah. What do you want for the two cameras? Uh, you got an old one there and a little wide up one there. Uh, two pounds. Two, two quid, yeah, that's fine, yeah. Is it? It's all oh, right. All oh, right. I have no idea what to do with you. Oh, yeah, they give you a trolley coin now. Trolley one, yeah. <laughs> they're good, but they're a pest as well when you're trying to find the bottom of your change in your pocket. There we go. Two pound. Do you want a bag? No, that's alright. I've got one. Thank you very much. Thank you. Lovely.
Excuse me. Look at these. <coughs> How much for these? You've got a couple of little figures and that in there. Uh, just, I don't know. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Like 25 pen. pence each. So what's call like that? 25, 50. All oh, right, you want them? Yeah. If I can take them all, yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, uh, so we'll go what? what Fifty two? pounds. One fifty. Two pound. So we shall what? Two fifty. Brilliant. That's fab. Two fifty. Fab. Yeah. Yeah. Look good on your transformers. Three pounds each. Those. Quite a rare ones. Those. We'll take a five for the pair. Uh, yeah, go on. Yeah. yeah. Change now. There you go, thank Probably you very much. Like what are these mystery boxes? Where's he gone? Mystery boxes, what are they? Uh, they're just little toys in them. You did say three, didn't <laughs> yeah, you? Three. There you go, sir. Sorry, thank you. Little toys and little figures, little dolls, things like that. Ah, oh, right, box. right, okay. I, I thought they were going to be Pokemon then, I was going to have some off you. No, there is. Undercover, last in the corner up there, he's got a big box for little Pokemon. Has he? Yeah, yeah, check them out, there, thanks. I've got no Jurassic Park, have you? I did. Or Schleck? Schleck, no Schleck. No. <laughs> Sometimes they'll schlep on light, but not today. No. Who are you every week, like? Yeah, me every week. Yeah. I don't. I said, I did every week last year, I'll try and do it this year. Have a look at this. I can't believe he's selling on eBay, so... Nah, I'm not on that one, yeah. I said, I'm not. You're on. Oh, yeah. You have a channel? I do, mate, yeah, Jay's Bargain. Uh, yeah. Got us a message on there, so I know what to do. Yeah. Just started inside, but I love doing this. Just yeah, so yeah I'll, I'll be doing some myself, like, but I wanted to get down today just to. Because it's just opened again, hasn't it? So. This is my little community there, we all Ah, right, okay, yeah. Shame they're kids, isn't it? It is. It's been nice and good. Two quid, mate, if you want to. Go on, I'll have them off you for two quid, mate, yeah. Yeah, you really... What's on your transfer? Yeah, that one, the fibre. Does it work? I don't think it's never been on the box. Beautiful for that, mate. How much for your hat? Your band's hat? Uh, the one red one. Here. The red one, yeah. Two pounds. Uh, give you a pound. Go on then. Oh, thank you. Lovely. Bye thank bye. you very thank much. You. Cheers. There's loads of stuff on there as well, isn't there? Yeah. I think they're all frozen, though. Yeah. Uh, 
Frozen, Disney princess. Someone said there was someone selling Pokemon over here, not you, no. Oh, yeah, it was. They've gone. Yeah. Damn. Sorry. <laughs> All right. Three quid, that one. Yeah. How much for your bag of Transformers? Uh, those ones are three. That one. How much? 50p. Can't argue with that, mate. <laughs> Is that one, yeah? Yep. Oh. 50 pence. 50 pence, yeah. Sorry, just one second. Oh. Uh, oh. It's all fun. Oh, easy. Fans for the PC. Yeah. I'll just get out of How many have you got in there? Uh, pass. <laughs> How much for the box? I'm asking anyway. Yeah. Uh, one, two, three, four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty, twenty-two, all together. How much for the loss? <laughs> <laughs> Looks through this. Forty. Twenty-two. Right. Yeah, go on then. Do you mind if I do a bit of research? No, it's fine. Yeah. How much was it? Like, uh, they're a pound each. How much did we say for the box? Uh, 40 for 22 of them. You say 30? I'll meet the middle 35. That's so probably the best I can do. Go on then. Would you put, if I give you the money now, would you keep yeah. the arm so I can come back for them? Yeah. You've got a fiver. Lovely, thank you very much. Uh, yeah, a bit. I'm into re reselling everything, mate, to be honest with you. I'm a reseller. Uh, module cables for PC. Uh, fiver. No, what do you plug it into? Uh, just a USB plug, yeah. It just runs USB on plug. a pound a piece. Yeah. Uh, there were power cables for a modular power supply. Right, uh, yeah. Yeah, fairly expensive online, but I'm not really yeah, expensive. Right, how much uh, you want yeah. for them, like? Yeah, I think Five for the pair? Yeah. Well, then I'll have them as well. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> There's your five over. Just stick them in that box, mate. Yeah, I'll be yeah. back. If you don't mind, that'd be brilliant, yeah. Just stick them over there. And that one. That's <laughs> cracking, mate. Thank you very much. Lay by service. I'll be back in the, probably about 10 minutes anyway. Cheers, mate. Thank you. How much for your two cars, please? Um, the the hot wheels are they the powered? Yeah, the powered wheels were one fifty. Was that a camera? It is, yeah. <laughs> it's all right. It's looking down. It's not looking at you. Are you streaming? I'm not streaming, no, but I'm a YouTuber. Oh, Alright. Yeah, yeah. yeah, so I do a bit of reselling. And it'd be rude not to film while I'm here, seeing as though it's the first day to open. Definitely. How much on your DS games? Yeah, I found each of the games. A four. Oh! Typical, <laughs> isn't it? How much are you Yeah, yeah. Uh, All of them. Like a bundle. A whole lot, yeah. I don't know how many is this. Should I count them? Can I count them? Of course you can. Yeah, so one, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 22 or 23 there with that them little one. Right. Uh, them little guys used to go over it. <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm so 
I'm so because some of them were different prices, you know, like I'd say couple for that, and then some of them were only like a pound. How many was it? Twenty three, I think, for the little men. But if we do twenty five for the lot. Mm. Okay, well. Going off your own. Yeah. It? Okay, then we'll do that. Cause yeah. I've got, yeah. I've got a bag. Go through them again. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think get, get them gone. Someone just bought another load as well. Someone like, yeah. you just your disconnect. I'm back. Hey. <laughs> Seven deadly sins. Never heard of that one. Is it an anime? Uh, anime, yeah. Is it? What's your price on that, mate? It did have 15 on it. Ten. Ten? Yeah. <laughs> I'll come to collect my gear as well, mate. Thank you. I'm a reseller on YouTube. Oh, nice. Yeah. Um, but I'm always about, um, you know, looking. Yeah. So, obviously, if you... Oh, we've never had one of them down here. <laughs> yeah. No, a YouTuber. Go, bro. Oh, a YouTuber. Yeah, go, bro. Go, bro. Oh, I didn't realise that. <laughs> I was just... <laughs> you tell her, Tom Martin, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, well, you tell Yeah, you all Every two weeks. Yeah, literally, like. Right. Every two weeks. Yeah, literally, like. Right. Every two weeks. 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 Alright guys, I think that went really well. I'm absolutely knackered now, like carrying all that to the car. I was going to go back in, but uh, I think I'll call it a day now. Spent probably around £100, I think, but we'll tot all that up at the end. Obviously, I'll take you through everything that uh, that we've bought. And uh, hopefully, hopefully, we've got some good bargains there. So, I'll see you on the other side. So, the first couple of things we got was this um, blood pressure monitor by Akerson. Uh, Ambidex. It looks in really good condition. As you've probably seen in the video, I did test it out and it seems to be working absolutely fine. It's pumping up. And then I think you're supposed to... God knows how these things work. But you give us that um, and a couple of stethoscopes. Now, the stethoscopes are a bit of a ball lot, to be honest, be honest with you. Especially this one, Spirit Original. I did um, a check on eBay. Uh, at some comps and these actually go for around 50 pounds so there's 50 quid right there um i should mention that i spent about 100 pound today at auction i'm not sure if i've already mentioned it. it needs a bit of a clean up that one feels a bit cheaper um but um i'll probably bundle bundle them up together the acus acusun or acosun um these go for around 30 35 pounds we then got this doctor's bag, bit of a theme going on here, doctor's theme. Um, it's made of leather, it's a nice thing. It needs a good clean up. Um, it's got a combination lock which works. Uh, I'm not sure how you set the combination on it, but yeah. It's a nice big thing. It's made by, the only thing I can find on it is BASF. I don't know what that stands for. This is like a, like a velvet feel. Um, it's a nice piece actually. And like I say, once, it, once I've given it a bit of a clean up and a buff, um it probably look look good these are hard to find so if anyone knows what sort of price we're looking at on one of these please leave a comment in the section but i'm gonna say as the guess of about 35 pounds right moving on next we've got these panasonic rp wf 930ts i've done a search on ebay for these and um yeah there seem to be not many comps on there um, there are other models similar to these and providing that they're working they're going for around £20 for them so we'll put a price tag of £20 on them next up we've got these two transformers I think there's a piece missing off this one though unfortunately that one looks like to be complete uh, with his gun as well um, these both are coming in at about £13 each so there's £26 there I'll probably sell them both together now this is a strange one I didn't know anything about these and uh, i took them as a punt really because they were so cheap at 25 pence each and i thought well there's got to be money in these even if it's a couple of pound i'll probably bundle the whole thing up if i'm honest with you but they're going for around 
from what I've seen anyway, and I haven't really had a proper look, but some of them are going for around five pound, five, five pound each. So uh, how many did we get? Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So if we say a conservative 30 pound for the bundle, I reckon we should get that. It's often good to get things that you don't really know much about. It's a learning curve and um, you know, obviously sometimes you can pick things up and it can be a win. And sometimes you can pick things up and be a, it can be a fail, but you know, until you do it and make them mistakes, you're not gonna learn. Next up is this Vans snapback in like a burgundy red color in pretty good condition. It has been used, but it still has the uh, the sticker on. So that's a good thing. Um, it could do with a bit of a clean, but they're going for around used five to 10 pounds. I think I paid a pound for that. Now these are Nike Magisters or Magister, however you want to pronounce it, Magister. Um, they are your sort of molded um, AstroTurf type football boots. These unfortunately, as you probably heard in the video, earlier on are a children's size six so they're nothing well i say a junior size six so unfortunately if they were adult ones especially the ones with the socks on they can command really good money then but probably looking at a price of i'm just checking my list 15 to 20 pounds for them i've got a couple of cameras off that lovely lady we got the olympic stuff off she didn't really know what to price them at I like to pick these old cameras up because you just never know. There are some bolos out there. Unfortunately, this isn't one of them. This is the Miranda Solo Twin MD in very good condition and with its original manual, which is quite good, you know, as a selling point as such. Um, this one um, goes for 15 to 20 pounds, that one. And the, the one that I thought would be worth more money because it looked older actually is worth less money. It's obviously got a bit of a problem there. They've used cellar tape to try and hold the battery cover on. Um, so there's obviously, you know, it's obviously got problems. But this one, the Prince Auto Line 3000 Tele goes for a 10 to 15, that one. We've got a big bundle of a Nintendo DS games. Obviously, there's certain ones that are worth a bit of money. Some of them aren't. This one in particular is worth quite a bit. When I say quite a bit five to ten pounds um but uh we picked up eight of them so i'm probably just going to bundle the whole lot together and ask for i don't know 25 pounds for them so next up is this optimus prime flip and change it's it's boxed it's never been out of the box but the box does look a little bit tired if i'm honest with you so it's not going to you know command excellent money um they are a bit hard to find on the completed plenty of used but not many boxed ones and these can go from anywhere between 25 to 50 pounds. Another box figure, the Seven Deadly Sins, Escano. Um, this guy is part of a anime, anime series. Not something that I am particularly um, clued up on. But uh, I thought with him being boxed, looks decent. This goes for around sort of 25 to 30 pounds. The very kind gentleman that looked after my gear for me um, chucked these in, um, set, gave me them both, I think, for, I think it was £5 for the pair, £2.50 each. These are what um, you call mod modular power cables in the packets. Now, these are quite hard to find on eBay. Um, the, the, the only ones I've found are from America. Um, as you can see, they're all, it's all there, uh, all in very good, brand new sort of condition. Um, and we're going to put a price on these of about... 12 to 15 each on them, so five pound into sort of 30 pound there. And from the same gentleman, he gave us this box of Antec P12 120 millimeter case fans, um, all brand new with the little bits and pieces. I paid 35 pound for this box, but each one of these goes on eBay for around eight pound a piece, so eight times 22. I'm not doing the maths now, but it's profit. Two monster trucks. One's like an Iron Man sort of design, um, and I'm not quite sure about the other one. I'm going to put a conservative value on these of around £10 each. Another box of goodies. These are the Leonardo collection. It's just tight, if I'm honest with you. But, you know, I think um, each one of these... You can get some really, really um, rare ones. The Elvis Presley being one of them. Unfortunately, there isn't an Elvis Presley one in here. But we've got all sorts of different ones going on here. I'll probably be asking for about £5 each for these. 
So how many have we got? Um, 10, 11, 12, 14. So that is 70 pound for the box. We've got this little bag of goodies. Um, I like picking these up now and again. He only charged me 50 pence for them. And to be honest with you, I haven't even had a look. So let's go through it together now. Couple of little transformers. There's another one. Is that another one? I think it's got bits missing on that one, I'm afraid. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure what that is. I'll have to Google Lens that one and find out what it is. If anyone knows what it is, please write in the comment section. Nice little Hot Wheels car there. Um, what's it say? Rev Rod. Um, and some little bits and pieces. I'm not sure what these are off. Looks like a little Roblox type guy, I think. What the heck is that? Arms, I don't know what they're off. <laughs> it doesn't look like these actually belong in this bag. But hey, hey. We'll keep them, you never know. Yeah, so if anyone has any ideas on what sort of prices are on these, please leave them in the comment section below. And the last deal of the day, which I was actually, which actually broke my heart, if I'm honest with you, when I got home, uh, I thought I'd done something really good. And I thought I'd got myself a load of Marvel um, figures for a um, silly price of £25. Would have worked out about a pound, pound a figure. Unfortunately, when I've got them home and had a look at them, I've realised that these are all, every single one of them, copies. And some of them... Uh, absolutely ridiculous copies, but in the throw of the conversation and whatnot and the excitement, I, um, yeah, I parted with £25, £25 British pounds for these, which are absolutely dreadful. Some of them, I mean, look at the, look at the eyes on him. Yeah, um, there was one. Thanos, look, look at, what is that? What is that? So guys, there's a bundle, a bundle of crap there, if I'm honest with you. All probably worth nothing. Unfortunately, that'll just be going probably back to the car boot when I do one myself. So there we go, guys. Not a bad haul, if I do say so myself, for the first car boot of the year. Um, I could have got myself back around there again probably and really got in amongst it all but time was ticking and I was aware of um, the fact that there was a lot of people there so chances are a lot of the good stuff probably would have went by the time I went back in there. I'm happy with what I got, I'm definitely going to make a profit on it. Some of the things I thought I was going to make mega money on, the figures being one of them things and unfortunately I haven't. But, uh, you know, it's one of the things you've got to you've got to try these things out. I'll learn from that now. And then obviously moving forward, I'll always check Marvel figures now to make sure that they are genuine. So that's something, you know, you can take from this. Instead of feeling down about it, just take it as a learning curve and uh, take on the chin and crack on. Anyway, guys, I really enjoyed going around the car boot. I hope you enjoyed watching and coming along with me. If, there are, if you have seen anything in the car boot that I've missed, then please drop it in this comment section below because obviously we're all learning here and uh, it's nice to uh, find out if I've missed anything, basically.